So what do I do when I see the rabbit? Chase it, catch it, feed on it. Isn't killing cute, defenseless animals the first step in becoming a serial killer? Well, you sort of skipped serial killer and went straight to vampire. Hey, Caroline, if you're not serious about all this, I think you should tell me. No, I am. Look, I swear that I am, okay? But it's just... I haven't been in the sun for days, and everyone's at the swimming hole having fun, and Matt is there, and he finally told me that he loved me, but I've been blowing him off, and now you want me to eat bunnies, and I'm kind of freaking out, okay? <sighs> and now you're laughing at me. No, no, I'm not laughing. None of this is funny, trust me. <laughs> it, it's just that, uh... What? When someone becomes a vampire, all of their natural behaviors get sort of uh, uh, amplified. What do you mean? I mean, as a human, I cared deeply for people, how they felt. Uh, if they were hurting, I felt their pain, and I felt guilty if I was the one who caused it. And uh, as a vampire, all of that got magnified. So you're saying that now I'm basically an insecure, neurotic, control freak on crack? Well, I wasn't going to say it like that, but hey, listen, let's hunt, OK? And then after that, we'll go to the swimming hole. Really? Yeah. Matt is the closest connection that you have to your humanity, and I think that being around him is a good thing. OK.